Hi guys, it's Chantel from Red Page Cafe. I'm here to do a little tiny tutorial uh, for Valentine's Day to share the love. So um, I hope you guys are all doing really well. I'll be doing the draw for the little skunk journal. This guy. <laughs> At um, 1 p.m. my my time so right now it's 10 a.m. so in like at 1 p.m. so anyways let's get started uh, these little um, little tiny itty bitty little envelopes can be made any size you just need a square piece of like uh, not too heavy scrapbooking paper works well and uh, any like origami paper you can get to they're very thin this paper is awesome thank you Kathy um <laughs> oh, well that's my daughter she's singing for you guys uh sorry about that but you know gotta love them she loves she loves her own voice I think okay so let's get started so you need these these are three by three inches and like I said any size will do so you grab your piece and fold it in like corner to corner, okay? Just like that, okay? And then you use your corners and you bring it across like that. I guess as straight as you can get it. It doesn't need to be perfect. And then you go across the other way. I believe April from Pink Oddbird has made something kind of similar to this. Now you could very easily make these and use them. Did I go too fast there? <laughs> In your junk journals. So one side and then this, this guy you want it in the corner there cross like that okay and I just fold both of them down to give a crease okay then I open them these little guys you do not you could use glue if you wanted to to glue it down but I like the fact that you don't need to um, you can also add an extra little you could keep it like add an extra little message inside now if you want to write something on your little flap like I did you could do it right now before you fill it up with little candies or you could do it after I'll show you how so you just close it up like this and then you fold it down Oops. and then you literally pop it open like that and it holds um, and then I just put little cinnamon hearts you like these you can't really put any more than four because it gets too stuffed up so just I just fold it in like that over the candies see and then you just squish it down like that and it holds pretty good considering you could put like a little staple here too if you wanted to or like hole make a hole it's up to you guys um it's just it's very versatile another thing you could do like let's say you're here and you're like oh I didn't write my note and I don't want to write on the candy you could just bring it down this way and then write your little note um they're kind of nice even if you don't fill them up with stuff you could put it like as a little pocket like let's see let's make another one <laughs> my daughter is singing oh my goodness i will have to listen to this and see uh if you guys can even hear me so again fold it in half right across and if you've got like double-sided uh, paper, like a thinner paper, they work awesome. I had some for my kids, but I think I used it all up. See? Corner to corner. And then fold it this way. Now you could stick it in your journal just like this. If you make it bigger, you could put a little bit of glue here, a little bit of glue there. Um, let me get a journal my journal you could stick it like in the corner or you could 
have them like do I have any spots that I could use probably not like you know tuck them in like this with a little paper clip and then you could stick them down like here and here if you make a bigger one and have it as a tuck spot this way and then you could you could glue it all the way down like this too and have it tuck spot here um, the nice thing is if you glue it down this way you can open it completely up and write in it if you wanted to. Another thing for like, what I'm going to do with these little guys is when I go to town this half a little later, I will be giving them out just randomly. So you put your little candy in there, put your little note. You could also write your note now if you wanted to. Another thing you could do, you could put a secret little message inside too if you like by opening it up. Anyways, there's so many different possibilities. I just thought I would share with you guys. So put your little candy in there. Whoops. And I hope you guys try it out and share the love. And uh, thanks so much. And I'll be back in a little bit with the random generator. There you go. Super simple. So fun. And uh, they actually hold pretty good. Like, with the candy inside. Like, the, I just put it over top seat. So, hope you guys have a spectacular day. Join in the fun. Give out some love. Um, be kind to each other. Open doors for random people. Uh, give out smiles, you guys, oh, when you're walking around today. It's Valentine's Day. It doesn't mean it has to be about buying stuff. You could just be kind and give out love. So, hope you guys have a spectacular day. And I will see you guys soon. Bye for now.